All right. Hi, my name's Roger Marino, a graduate of Northeast in 1990. <laughs> <laughs> no worries. I wish. <laughs> what was the question again? I'm sorry, it's been 30 seconds. <laughs> When people talk about Roger Marino, Roger Marino, Roger Marino, Roger Marino, Roger Marino, they talk about the great entrepreneur he is. They talk about the impact he has made. When I think of Roger, I think of a man that embodies everything that we look for in a trustee. A man who's generous with school, who's generous with his time, who is a leader in the community, a great entrepreneur. Well, Roger grew up in Revere, Massachusetts, and uh, in my opinion, he was lucky to get into Northeastern University. <laughs> I was told a story many years ago, Roger, about how when you were an undergraduate, your father used to drop you off before he went to work every day, right around the corner from campus. All that you've done in your life as a, a successful entrepreneur, uh, as a great benefactor to the university, I know he would be very proud of you like we all are. When people talk about Roger Marino, they talk about this generous person who empowered students and gave them the opportunities to study, to be healthy, and to achieve their dreams. When people talk about Roger Marino, they talk about the family man he is. In addition to all these attributes, I see someone who has a great heart. I saw him cry when he heard the Torch scholars talk about their stories. If it weren't for donors or if it weren't for those connections, I wouldn't be here. I wouldn't have the opportunity to follow my dream. If I were to start to describe Roger, it's with his heart. And Northeastern is a part of his heart. Roger embodies the special brand of entrepreneurship that we have here at Northeastern. It is a combination of real creativity, hard work, and grit. No one embodies that better than Roger. Working hard means that you accumulate as much information and knowledge as you can in various uh, aspects of life because someday you're going to be able to use pieces of it to make you successful. As everybody knows, every golf match is won or lost on the first hole. And I always would ask Roger, what is your handicap? He tells me about his knee replacement, tells me about his hip problem, tells me about his tra travels up north to go to the dentist. Roger, a handicap is a number, not a story. <laughs> Those of you that uh, visit the Marino Center certainly know his name very well. It's awesome. I love it up here. It's definitely the nicest gym I've ever been in. The Marino Center is probably one of the proudest parts of Roger's life. It is the jewel in the crown. It's just my opinion. <laughs> I was skiing at Loon and a couple came up to me and they introduced themselves and they said they met at the Marino Center and got married later on. And I said, that's amazing. He says, no, no, it happens to a lot of people. <laughs> so it's also become a dating center. I can't say how proud I am. I tell everybody everywhere I come in contact with about Northeastern and how great it is. On a lighter note, I had the pleasure and the privilege to have many beers with you and I'm looking forward to having many more. Congratulations, Roger.